Let's see how quick we can create a three universal app. Let's start with the black app template. And the first thing I'm going to do is add a reference to the ESR runtime NuGet package. So we're just going to pick that from nuGet.com. Going to accept this, install it in both the Windows Store and the Windows Phone project heads. Click to reload. You'll now see the references. They have a little warning sign because we have to switch from a new CPU. There we go. Warning signs are now gone. Let me delete the main page from the store project. And I'm going to take my Windows Phone main page and just move it into share so we can share that main page view. Next, we'll add the namespaces needed. First, the controls namespace for the 3D controls available. And we'll add the layers namespace for all the data we want to layer on top of each other into the view. Next, let's add the scene view. There's a scene view that's also a 2D map view control. And the scene view has a scene that defines all the data that's in it. And we'll basically define a layers that we can layer on top of each other. And there's a whole bunch to choose from here. Um, OpenStreetMap, for instance. But we're going to go with the ArcGIS Tile Map Service layer. And we're going to point it to an endpoint that defines where the data for this one is. And this is the World Imagery Service on ArcGIS Online. Next, I'm going to add an elevation as well so we can get some mountains and ridges and canyons in here and again i'm just going to point to a world elevation service here that we're going to use and that's it let's try and click run so here we have the 3d control let's zoom into the alps see we've actually got some elevation as well there you go let's add a little more data in here for instance, let's add a KML file. So I'm just going to drag a file in here to my share. Here's the London I KML file, or KMC in this case. And we're just going to change the build action to content. And we're going to add a KML layer in this case. KML layer source URI is MS app X slash london i that can see done let's hit f5 we run it let's try and zoom into london and see if the london i is now available to find it it's over here there you go a full 3d model inside your view now let's do the same thing for windows phone which is a starter project and we'll just hit run. And let's see if that works on the phone as well. And it does. Here we have the map. Let's zoom in a little bit. Let's see, we have the mountains. Looks like it. Let's go and find the London Eye. It's got lost. In. Let's go there. There we go. 